Praise the Lord. Yeah, let's do that together for ourselves. Some people don't know the song. But why I, why I wanted us to sing this song is the first part of the song says, See the way you love me, see the way you care for me. You know, they carry my matter to pay. Is that true? Is that true? Yes. You know, the Bible says that if God be for us, who can be against us? If God be for us, who can be against us? Nobody. And this, the opposite is also true. If God is against a person, can any be for that? Can anybody be for that person? If God is against somebody, say, no way for you. Can it work for the person? Praise the Lord. I want to just conclude this message at the beginning. The conclusion of this message that God dropped in my heart is this. God wants, wants us to know everybody here seated that he's for you. Amen. That's what? He's what? God is for you personally. That God is not against you. Please, I want our attention to be here 100%. Because eh? I'm seeing some people that are looking at something else. Your mind is not here. This message is very important. Eh? God woke me up very early this morning. Say, all your message have been prepared. Look at that message. Now, this one, I want you to tell them. Praise the Lord. The message is that God is for you. What's the message? God is not against you. And since God is for you, nobody can be against you. I don't know, maybe some people are here, maybe afraid that, hey, because generally in Africa, we have this belief. We have this belief that, hey, maybe I don't come to jazz from you, from the village, where they say, village problem. Say that if I, if I too shy, they'll bring me down. But do you know that the reason you are not down, all those witch wizards, they are true, they are real. But God's love for you is more real. It's because God is for you. That's why you are here. You are, you are still working in the Fetuli farm. Because if you leave death where, the plan that you have for you is very bad. You should not be here. You should not even be alive. You should not be sick. You should, have, you should not, be, not be able to walk. Or some people, you, you, you don't plan grace for them. But because God is for you, that's why you are here. Amen. The goodness of God eh, lead them to repentance. The goodness of God implies that God day your side. God day your side. Can anybody be against you? Can Tinubu be against you? Can the economy be against you? I saw before I came up here, God just flashed an image in my spirit. Eh? In heaven, is let me see, is, let me put this, or let me just get one of my papers. Eh? I just saw something in heaven before I came here. In heaven, eh, when people at the beginning of the day, eh, it is God that gives us life. It's like a flash. They bring release of people that are alive to God and say, see the people when they are alive for X today. Eh? They come put all the names. Then they say, number one, eh, America, they are alive. Number two, okay, Balogu. What's your name, sir? Eh, Mudiaga. Okay, so Mudiaga, they are alive. He say, okay, everybody, they sleep oh, normally. He say, number one, they come ask God. They just say, come ask God, number one. Make you wake up. I say, make you wake up. Eh, no, <laughs> I personally wake up. And you are now shining. Number two, make you wake up. He said, yes. Number three, yes. Number four, he said, no. <laughs> Do you know that some people, God did not approve their waking up? Is it true or false? Between yesterday and this morning, it was not approved. But your own was approved. Can somebody shout hallelujah? That's the goodness of God. There was, look, no matter what, how powerful a man is in this life, he cannot approve his life. There was a time Abacha, do we remember Abacha? How many people remember Abacha? Abacha had so much power, eh? No, that I heard that in Asso Rock, there was a time he was afraid for his security. He put Lion inside. He said, make Lion the guider. It makes so that nobody will come and kill him. If you plan coup, he will discover your coup, he will kill you. He jail up after you, do all kind of things. But, and at the end, they now had one party say, we want to do election. All of them say, now who the car fit? Do you remember that thing? Who the car fit? You remember? All the party can say, five parties, they say, we want one man. God just is man. He said, don't worry, I'm still giving you long room. In the end, because the way he planned the thing, he set Nigeria, no fit stop him. A pastor could not stop him, nobody could stop him. But there was somebody seated in heaven that said, okay, no, don't wake up. By the time he wanted to die, could anybody stop his death? Did he have the power to stop his death? If America could not stop, and, and United States of America.
Amer America. They could just talk, talk, talk. He took to for here. Yeah. He had he hold Nigeria strong. But by the time God said no, could anybody say yes? Listen, when Jesus said yes, nobody can say no. What if he said no? Hallelujah. Maybe we should be singing that one. <laughs> but the message is this. God couldn't necessarily have to repent as God would have me tell everybody sitting here, I'm for you. I am what? I do your side. Nothing they happen. Go. Praise the Lord. Eh, in case your village is not here, eh, you want you have to fear to go village. God said, Don't worry. If time reaches to go village, go. No fear. I do your back. He said, I am for you. And if God is for us, who can be against us? Nobody. They're not born that wish. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. God's goodness needed to repentance. So that's the conclusion of the message. At the beginning of the message. In case you are worried, you are fearful, or you are doubting that hey, God no love me. God wants me to tell you this morning. He said, I am for you. I am on your side. And because I'm your, on your side, nobody can be against you. Sickness cannot take you. Nothing can take you before your time. Amen. Nothing. Praise the Lord. It's just I don't want to because we are all working here in the Fetuli farm. But if they tell you, say, oh, God say, eh? That word, oh, God say, anything when follow for the back of oh, God say, go to him or you go to him. You must do it. Once you say, oh, God say, that's the end of it. Abi, how much more God? Praise the Lord. How much more? His word is the fantasy. And his word is in your favor in the name of Jesus. I say his word is in your favor. God's goodness. God is good to you. But that's not the end of the story, oh. Eh? Let's open to Romans. Romans chapter 8. God's goodness leads to repentance. God's goodness means that God is on your side. Romans chapter 8, verse 28 to 39. Can somebody read King James Version for me? Romans chapter 8, verse 28 to 39. Very quickly, oh, please. Yes. Mike. Mike. Follow, please, oh. Follow. Go ahead, sir. Yes. And he might be the first born among many brethren. Yes. Moreover, whom he did predestinate, then he also called. And whom he called, them he also justified. And whom he justified, them he also glorified. 31. Yeah. The, what shall we then say to these things? If God be for us, who can be against us? Did you hear that? Did you hear that? If God be... Answer now. If God be... Who can be against us? Go ahead, sir. And the truth, he that spared not his own son, but delivered him up for us all, how shall he not, how shall he not with him also freely give us all things? Mm -hmm. Who shall lay nothing to the charge of God's elect? Anything. Who shall lay, any, is there anything or nothing? It is God. Sorry, sir. Can you repeat that? Who shall lay? Okay. Who shall lay anything? Okay. To the charge of God's elect. Yes. It is God that justifies. Yes. Who is he that condemns? It is Christ that died. Yea, rather, that is risen again. Who is even at the right hand of God. Who also maketh intercession for us. Right, sir. 35. Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? Shall tribulation or distress or persecution or famine or, or, or nakedness or peril or swell? As it is written, for thy sake we are killed all the day long. We are accounted as sheep for the slaughter. 37. Yes. Nay, in all things we are more than conquerors through he that loved us. 38. For I am persuaded. That neither death, nor life, nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers, nor things present, nor things to come, 
nor height, nor dirt, nor any other creature shall be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus our Lord. Praise the Lord. Did you see that? He said that I am for you. Nobody can be against you. When you were a sinner, I gave you Jesus Christ. And when we're yet sinners, God gave us Jesus. He's not asking, what is it that I cannot give you? If I've given you my son, Jesus Christ, is there anything that I cannot give you again? Eh? The Bible said that he gave his son. I want to read from easy to read version. So you have easy to read, but I want to read from here. Listen, no. he said, for we know that in everything, God works for the good of those who love him. These are the people God chose because that was his plan. 29. God knew them before the, he made the world and he decided that they would be like his son. Then Jesus would be the firstborn of many brothers and sisters. God planned for them to be like his son. He chose them and made them right with him. And after he made them right, he gave them his glory. 31. So what shall we say about this? If God is for us, no one can stand against us. And God is with us. He even let his own son suffer for us. God gave his son for all of us. So now, with Jesus, God will surely give us all things. Who can accuse the people God has chosen? No one. God is the one who makes them right. Who can say that God's people are guilty? No one. Jesus Christ died. For but that is not all. He was also raised from the dead. And now he's at God's right hand, speaking to him for us. Can anything separate us from Christ's love? Answer. Okay. Can trouble or problems or persecution separate us from his love? Okay. If we have no food or clothes or face danger or even death, would that separate us from his love? 36. As the scriptures say, for you, we are in danger of death all the time. People think we are worth no more than sheep to be killed. But in all these troubles, we have complete victory through God, who has shown his love for us, 38 to 39. Yes, I am sure that nothing can separate us from God's love. Listen, oh, death, life, angels, ruling spirits, I am sure that nothing now, nothing in the future, no powers, nothing above us and nothing below us, nothing in the whole created world will ever be able to separate us from the love God has shown us in Christ our Lord. Praise the Lord. Did you hear that? You heard it. So the message is simple. God is saying, I am for you. That is, I am good to you. The goodness of God leads to repentance. But as he is for you, so, eh? God, there your side. Man. Really? God, side. Eh? But as he is for you, are you for him? Amen. You know, God is for you. God did your back. God did your back. But the question is, this year, he's asking you, I want you to be for me. As I am for you, be for, be for what? Be for me means, this year, decide that you'll be reading your Bible every day. This year, decide that you will not be one leg in, one leg out. Praise the Lord. As I'm for you, be for me. God's goodness led to repentance. Eh? Be for me means that this year you'll be praying in the morning every every day. It means that this year, eh, if you didn't drink, you didn't drink too much. Stop it. Start reading your Bible more. Praise the Lord. Be for me, be for God. This year means if you were lying before, don't lie again. Praise the Lord. Because if God is for you, eh, you should also be for Him. Praise the Lord. Who is on the Lord's side here? Can I see your hand? God wants you to be on his side. That's the repentance. My goodness needed to repentance. I am on your side. I dare your back. Don't worry. Can it go? Nothing there. Nobody can for your time. Amen? But at the same time, you yourself decide to be for God. Preach the gospel. Praise the Lord. Love. Obey his word. Read his word. That's how we can be for God. Because truly, eh, if God is for you, Nobody can be against you. And that's what the goodness of God is all about. It means I am for you. The leader to repentance means, okay, God, me self, I am also, I'm also for you. I want to just say two, two examples of people in the Bible where eh? God was for them. 
and no, nothing could harm them. The first one is the children of Israel. They were, they just came out just like the children of, the, with the workers of the Veturi farm. Eh? He gets some battles and eh? God they fight for you, you don't even know. They, they shoot arrow on you, on many of us here. They shoot you arrow, but you don't know. But because God is for you, that's why the arrow did not work. And it can never work. Praise the Lord. The children of Israel, they came out of Egypt. So, they come to, they, not, not me as they call them, we want to be with you, eh? Uh -huh, good. So as they as they came out, they wanted to do do, uh, do them yes. I think I can't call them. Eh? Yes. Uh -huh, now you good. They want to do them yes. So as they came out of the land of Egypt, Balaam, eh? He called. He said, No, no, no. These people, eh? If I fight them, I know if you win them. So what shall I do? I will curse them. Eh? I will do truth for them. I'll do incantation for them. I'll go to my shrine. He now called his high priest. The name of the high priest was Balak. Is what? Balak. Balak. He said, Balak, come. I know say you get power where you are a strong human. I want you to do things this way. Eh? Cause them so that they will, it will, it will, it will, they will be confused. Just cause them, don't do them something. It's the spirit, in the spiritual realm. That's Numbers chapter 23, if you are writing. Numbers chapter 23, 24, 22, 23, 24. He now said, do them something. He now did the juju. He now started doing the incantation. He said, children of Israel, okay, as I kill this fowl, as I put the blood on the ground, so and so, so, so will happen. He now threw the arrow on them. Pia, God now took the arrow. He turned it. He turned it to blessing. Praise the Lord. That's the same thing that's happening for many of you here. They threw arrow on you. But as they threw the arrow like this, Pia, God take the arrow. Thank you. You come bless you on top. They come give you Christmas. Somebody can send you a lot. <laughs> you don't know. Yeah, you didn't know. You don't know. You do your own. They just enjoy yourself. Come here, clap for money. But at the back, at the back of the scene, something they happen. Something they happen for the back. You didn't know. He threw them arrow. But as he said, hey, the man now said, sure. I called you to call this people. You bless them. He said, I bet no verse, no verse. Now, now waiting, enter my mouth. You no, know, no, say, God, turn my mouth. That's the same God who turned the mouth of the enemy. Because they're supposed to come to turn. That's the goodness of God. They say, okay, fine. Since it did not work on this side, let's go to that side. Now I went to this side. He said, if you see them from another angle, maybe the bears will work. So now I say, do you call the man? Call the do the this is as I do like this, I just call the top many, 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 many. As you just talk the word like this. Make it happen for you share to happen like this. God just take the word. He said, You are blessed. Sure? You are blessed again. He said, No verse. It's God. God just turned the thing. Turned my, he turned my mouth. That is the same thing God is doing for you. That's the goodness of God. Praise the Lord. He said, okay, the last chance now. He said, no, he said, I think it was four or even seven places. He said, change your location. He said, we are stand from here now. Look, the people in a Fetuli worker, they cost them. He now stick through another arrow. As you treat the arrow again, it turned to what? Yes. That is what? Goodness of God. That's what. That is to tell you if God is for you, nobody can be against you. No witch, no wizard. You know, they, even if it is your, well, okay, let me, we're helping you, your organ. So far, God said no. Nobody can say yes. Amen. Yes. When Jesus says yes, let me, let me, the version B of the song. When Jesus says no, Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I have good news for you. God is saying that I have the last card, the joke I did in my hand. It's not your organ. It's not your village priest. It's not your king, self. It's me. Praise God. And he said, I, want, I should tell you I'm on your side. Amen. I'm here. So be on my side. Praise the Lord. That's the message for us this year. I am good to you. I'm on your side. You too, as I'm on your side, you to be on my no more fornication. No. Stop. 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 Please. No more fornication. That's how you can be on the side. Praise the Lord. Another example of somebody in the Bible that God was on the side. But uh, let, let me just let me just drop this. Eh? Those children of Israel, as Balaam, he caused them for this side. He know what? He caused them for this side. He now came to the center. He went. He did what? Do you know what he now did? You know what he now did? He said, "Hey, God is for them. What can I do? I still want to do their parents." He now, the next chapter, that's chapter 25, he now went to go and tell the Moabite girls, all these girls, the short, 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 short,
You now send, you now, you now send them inside the camp. Go and be sleeping with them. Eh? Go and be sleeping with the men. You understand? As that will not happen, he said, God now said, Oh no, what is this? Immediately gone out. Immediately, that's when 24,000 of them now died. You see the manipulation? He knew that he cannot cause them by himself with his own power. He now decided to use to hire prostitutes, hot hot girls, with short short skirts. Eh? He said, Go, go, go. Enter the camp. Enter the farm. Then they commit fornication. Steady. Just enter. Eh? As that will happen, hey, God said, Hey, shh. No, no, no. I cannot be whole sin. God himself is the one that killed 24,000 people. If God be for you, who can be against you? And if God be against you, who can who can be for you? If God is against you, who can be for you? So what if God is saying that? Remove your hand from sin. Praise the Lord. Second person that God is for. David, Psalms chapter 23 verse 1. He said, the Lord is my shepherd. I shall not. He makes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the his waters. He guides me the path of righteousness for his name's sake. He said, even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will not fear. Why? Why? Yes, he's with you. So don't be afraid of darkness. Don't be afraid of it. Don't be afraid of it. Don't be afraid of suffering. Just make sure that God is with you and you are with God. Praise the Lord. Say, so what if they sack me today? The question is, is God with you? Praise the Lord. Make sure that God is with you. And then also make sure that you, you are with God. Then look at the last verse of Psalm 23. He said, surely, goodness and mercy. Don't forget, he said, because thou art with me. The last verse, Psalm 23 verse 6, now said, surely, goodness and mercy will. Why? Because God is with me. Do you get it? If they get the gist, why will goodness and mercy follow you? Because God is with It's not you, you will follow goodness and mercy. Do you know many of us, we are, we are following goodness and mercy. They find goodness. Eh? Say that they share something. If they struggle, I must get my own. I must get my own. I must fight too. I must, I must blow somebody. I will tear your head. Eh? When goodness, they come. If they chase goodness, wrong. Goodness is supposed to chase you. Only you, you stay like this. Goodness will come and meet you. Will gravitate towards you when God is with you. So stop chasing goodness this year. That's why he says, seek the kingdom of God's righteousness, and all these things shall be added. They will look for you. You are not the one to be looking for them. I beg, help me, help me, help me. No, you go there your side. They will come and meet you. I want to help you. That's how it works. When God is with, when God is what? With you. That was the case of David because God was with him. People start come to help him. Goodness will look for you this year in the name of Jesus. Mercy will follow you this year in the name of Jesus. I said, goodness will locate you. You will not be looking for men to help you. They will look for you. They will look for you. But God is with and you to be with God. Praise the Lord. I think I need to round up here. I just have one minute left. Praise the Lord. Okay, I'll just end it finally with somebody. The last person now. I've said two examples of two people God was with. When God is with you, no shaking. But there's one person that God was not with. And many actually. God was against them. I've told you about about him. There's another person in the Bible. God was not with him. His name was Saul. His name was what? The goodness of God left him. Praise the Lord. It left him because he was disobedient. In the end, he started looking for the goodness. He now went to to Juju girl, to what do they call it? Witch. Go meet witch. He said, witch, I beg. This one when I call God, so God not hear me. You call God for me. Eh? He went to meet divine and say, help me, help me. God is not talking with me. God is not with me. I need the anointing. Meanwhile, it is misbehave, me, mis misbehave, back to back. Praise the Lord. Do you know that even in the house of the witch, eh, when God was supposed to come, God now said, this is for you. God now really show up. Bam. He said, if they call me since I know answer, you can't go meet me, shall be to call me. He said, I don't come now. You will die. <laughs> Praise the Lord. That's when God is against the man. Nobody can save him. Praise the Lord. But I have good news for you this morning. As you woke up, God took your register. I'm for you. I'm for you. No shaking. Go. Carry on. That your project. You want to go into some seed. Because I'm with you. Only this year, you be with me. That is the repentance. Praise the Lord. I want you to close your eyes and begin to talk to God. God, this year, I want to be for you. Show me how I can be for you. Teach me how I can be for you. Show me what I need to do 
so that I can show that I'm on your side. As you did my back, so me too, I want to be on, I want to be with you. Anything that is not good in my life that you want me to grow, please Lord, show it to me, Lord. Because this year, this year, 2024, I'll be on your side. I'll not be on the side of the devil. As you are for me, me too, I'll be for you. I will repent as a response to you. Yes. Oh Lord Jesus. Lord, we are giving our hearts to you. Come on, talk to God. Talk to God. If you really know you are for God, this is the opportunity for you to talk. Oh, he's listening. Oh. God, they hear. Oh. Talk to God now. Say, God, this year I will be for you. I will be with you. Every wrong thing in my life that is not correct, that you don't like, Lord, today I'm dropping it. And I will be on your side. 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 Oh, thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Father, thank you for your word that has come this morning. Lord, we are praying, we are asking in our lives, anything that is not like you, that you don't like in our lives, cut it away in the name of Jesus. Any relationship, any bad habit that has been with us in 2023, the thing has crept into January. Lord, today, we drop it in the name of Jesus. I pray for everyone that is anyone, including myself, that may be struggling with something you don't like. Lord, please cut it away from us in the name of Jesus. Help us to be for you 100% in the name of Jesus. We will not be for you 99%. We will not be for you 99.99999. We'll be for you 100% in this year in the name of Jesus. And you will be for us in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. We declare that this day's work is blessed in the name of Jesus. Our MD is family is blessed in the name of Jesus. Every enterprise concerning this concerning fellow and all the subsidiaries that are blessed in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father. Even for our families are our loved ones, Lord. Anyone that has an issue concerning a loved one, the decree is set in the name of Jesus. Your goodness reaches us, reaches our family in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name.